Good morning, everybody. There's Brennan. Good morning, love. Uh, Hola. It's a little chilly this morning. Yesterday was a beautiful day. So today we're heading out. It is Saturday morning and head into Brennan's water polo tournament. He is playing a lot of water polo these days. Hold on, I gotta get my keys. Oh, they're in my hand. Nice. All right, good luck, B. All right, you guys, I arrived home. Everybody else is still sleeping. It's 8.30. And then, today we have a big day, we're going to Pennsylvania. It is my brother's birthday, so we are gonna have a bowling party and a surprise dinner. Actually, it's a surprise bowling party too. He doesn't know we're going to be there. It's going to be very fun, but this is the dilemma. The dilemma is this. I already told my mom, who's putting the party together, that our whole family was going to be there. That was before I knew that our high school boys basketball team was going to be playing for the state championships tonight. So of course Brennan and Katie want to go to that. I know it was like in high school and I really, really would want to go and I would hate for them to not go to that, but we already committed to this party. So what do you guys think? Ryan and Charlie are awake. Look at that hair, Ryan. It's pretty nice, right? That is pretty nice. How are you, Charlie? Charlie wakes Good. up. His hair is fine. Like, I know, it's like perfect. Like that yeah, he can take care of that. Crazy. All right, Mickey Mouse pancakes this morning, late, or Mickey Mouse waffles? waffles? Gentlemen, sounds good. You want to pour one? Yes, that's what we got. Okay, it is officially, I'm telling you, 10.30, Katie's still in bed. I'm talking to Molly. Hi, Molly, are you still in bed, Molly? Hi Molly, you girls are lazy. Um, I woke up at 7.30 technically. Oh my gosh, and you've been in here for three hours? Yeah, I've been making playlists. Listen. Yeah, I woke Molly up. You're welcome. Are you gonna come to Brennan's water polo game? Mm, it's not bad, actually maybe. He just played one this morning and they won, so then he has another one. I love how Brennan already played a whole water polo game. I so it's and you're so so Exactly. <laughs> Molly, are you going to the game tonight? <laughs> Funny story. <laughs> oh, what happened? Okay, so short, long story short, Molly, her mom signed her up for this camp thing, like this young government something camp, and she really didn't want to go. And um, her mom was like, "You have to go," and she was like, "Fine, like I'll li literally email the director myself and tell him that I'm not going." And <laughs> and. And her mom was like, yeah, okay, you do that. <gasps> oh no, Molly did it. emailed the director, said that she wouldn't be making it. Oh! And then, and then her mom was like, all right, so, like, like, do you want to get an outfit for tomorrow? And she's like, no mom, like, I'm not oh. going. And so she was like, what? And then she like, <laughs> that she lost it. And she took her phone and. Wait, so how is she FaceTiming you right now? She got it back. But she's grounded for a month. Molly, Molly, Molly. Okay. Like, yeah, right. you told she me you were gonna do it. She was gonna do it. Well, maybe mom. But, but then you kept making negative comments, which probably wasn't a good idea. <laughs> she was like, her dad was like oh, asking no. her mom if she wanted to come in the hot tub with him and Molly, and Molly literally goes, "Negativity spreads through water." Oh my gosh, <laughs> she, Molly, you've got to respect your mom. No, it's so funny. I Wait, what do you so mean no. no? No, you've got to respect no, your mom. I think it's hilarious. All right, this is going south fast. All right, Kate, this is the deal. We're going to Uncle Tim's birthday party today, and you want to go to the basketball game tonight. Yes, ma'am. So it's basically family versus friends. Who's going to win out in this case? Except for the fact that this is probably the only time we're ever going to make it to States. This is the only time Uncle Tim is going to turn big five yeah, zero. Yeah, he has a birthday next year, too. Are you going to go to his birthday party next year? Unless we make it to States. <laughs> oh, no. Are you going to call Nana and tell her that you're not coming? No. Who's going to do that? That would be you. Why me? Because you're my mom. Oh, Katie. This is the deal. You have to do a video for Uncle Tim. And if you stay here, you, I would like to see um, some vlog from that. I would like to see what you guys are doing and Oh, stuff. can I spend the night at Natalie's tonight? No. With Ellie and Caroline? No. All right, we are on our way to Molly's. Kate, you going over to Molly's? Yes, ma'am. I thought she was grounded. I thought we just heard she was grounded. Yeah. Oh. Okay. What'd but you do? 
she, <laughs> she's not, she's, it's, not, it's, not, it's like funny because it's not even something bad. Like, it's not like but she but thing. she went against her mom, which what? I think. No, she, it's just not that bad. Her, her mom was making her go to this government camp thing and she didn't want to go because she like actually like hates that kind of stuff. And so her mom was like, you're going. She was like, I'm not going. She was like, I will like email the, the person and tell them that I'm not going. And she was like, yeah, okay, you won't. And so she literally emailed the person and said that she wasn't going. Oh my gosh. And then her mom was like asking her if she's ready to go. And she was like, no, like I emailed him. And she was like, you actually did. So yeah, so she's like not she's going. Grounded. Wow. So she's grounded now. But she's not allowed to go anywhere, but I guess people are allowed to come visit she's a rebel. her. She is a rebel, that Molly. I love it. All right, Ma, or Kate, whoever you are, have a good time. We're gonna go to the Brennan's water polo game, and then we probably won't see you, because you're gonna stay Somebody here, right? Somebody will wither, man. Kisses. Oh. <laughs> okay, uh, bye, Katie, love you, I'll see you tonight. Don't come back. Look at my baby. He got a new collar. Oh, he doesn't like it. Oh, 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 careful. Oh, Edward, buddy. Oh, gosh, hold on. All right, he's good. They need to have them because they've started to go outside a bit, and we need to put our identification on them. I wanna make sure our little dudes don't get lost and we can find them and all that stuff, so. Anywho, <laughs> it's, you know, getting used to it. All right, Brennan just finished water polo, staying here, and I'm um, gonna go with his friends. But you're gonna send a video to Uncle Tim, right? Wishing him happy birthday? Yes. Okay, you can tell him that right now too if you want. Uncle Tim, happy birthday, man. Thank you for being such an awesome uncle. I'm really sorry that we couldn't make it this weekend, but we really miss you, and um, thanks for always being there for us. Awesome spending time with you. I'm gonna miss you, but we'll see you soon. Fabulosity. Happy birthday. Have Thank you. Thank you. Oh, 50. Oh, 50. excellent. Yes. Big it's one. a big one. That's why we're celebrating. And I'm just sad that you guys aren't gonna be there, but I understand your plight. All right, very good. So we'll see you tonight. Will you vlog for us so we can see what's going on at the game and everything? Probably not. It's very exciting. Really? It's great. All right. Love you. Bye. Hello ladies and gentlemen, um, me and Molly are like tanning <laughs> and here's the funny part, it's like 53 degrees, <laughs> but it doesn't feel like 53 degrees, it's like really sunny, I don't know if you can see the sun, it's like hot, yeah, it's like, <laughs> but it's been so cold recently, we're just not used to it, so we're literally like on towels like tanning. Like yesterday, it was like 80. Yeah, Marilyn's really bipolar, so anyway guys, that's what's going on, listening to music, eating some popcorn. <laughs> okay, bye. Actually, how are we gonna like throw it? Let me try it. Let me see that. Bro, so after like 10 years, we finally got the soccer ball. We was stuck up there. We threw a little javelin thing at it. We put a chair up there. So I may or may not have stolen someone's field hockey ball. Yeah, wait, where are the balls? Are they down there? There they are. One and two. Some time with the volleyball. I got no idea. I'm just gonna eat this water bottle. Out of it. <laughs> All right, you guys, we are in the car and we have driven about an hour and a half and we are almost there. So, again, what we're doing today is we're going to, well, at least the three of us are, we're going to Uncle Tim's birthday party. It's a surprise party at a bowling alley. So, we're on our way to the bowling alley right now. He is not there yet, but we will see my sister Wendy and you guys know. Oh, we're here, we're here, yay! Oh, we're here. oh my gosh, yes! Here we go. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, this is fancy. I like it. Wendy, this is my sister Wendy. You know that. Oh, happy birthday, Tim! <laughs> <laughs> you're 
Oh, yeah, nice. Nice. That's the we have. Yeah. I don't know. Does it say it? It says ten pounds. Ten, ten pounder, pounds. Wendy. What should it that's be? like a turkey. No, no that's it's, good. It's I guess. It's whatever, I have no whatever, idea. Whatever you, whatever you can. Do. And this is cousin Carly, Aunt Wendy, and Uncle Tom. There's Uncle Tom. What'd you get, Uncle Tom? Yeah, eleven and a half to fourteen. Nice. All right. Shoot. <laughs> And a half That's perfect. Not the opposite. Not an 11 pound ball and a 14 and a half. You'd be Shaquille O'Neal. That would be disastrous. <laughs> throw on my first ball and then if I need a spare ball I have this one. Really? So yes. I mean if you don't get them all done with that ball. If I don't get them, them correct. Correct. Apparently that's like what you were doing. You're like an expert bowler. Good job Tim and Tim won both. Congratulations the birthday boy comes in and wins. Thank you. Thank Very you. nice. You. Very nice. All right we're gonna go home now to Nana Paps and have dinner. Are you ready? You ready for dinner? Yeah. Let's go do it. funny you guys but we made it to Nan and Pap's house. Pap is a renowned puzzle doer. Is that what you call it? A puzzler? A puzzler? That's what the Grinch is. He says they puzzle till the puzzlers are sore. But this is a puzzle doer. So this is Pap's puzzle here. Wendy, I'm gonna just come through and you can see. Okay. How many a thousand piece puzzle. Yeah. Dad, how long did that take you so far? I've been working five days. Oh my god. That's gosh. it? Five days? <laughs> Have you mm. ever seen anything like this? Mm, no. Shepherd's pie, corned beef and cabbage, salad. Mm. Wendy, that looks, it, I wish we had smell vision because I'm telling you what, it smells fantastic. Happy birthday, dear Tim. Happy birthday to you. There's an Oreo cookie on it. And a votive. Nice. Happy Said underdogs who? Yeah. Said underdogs who? Yeah. Said underdogs who? Underdogs who? Hi guys. A lot with a minute and 36 seconds left in the second quarter. But hopefully we'll make a comeback. I'm feeling pretty great about this one. Welcome back. We lost by a lot. We lost by like 30 points, but it's okay. We're still proud of them. <laughs> for making it that far. Okay. All right, you guys, it's time to go. Our dinner has finished. These guys are like stressing about the puzzle. It is great. You want to sleep over? Oh, yeah, you want to stay? Yeah, you can stay. We changed all the sheets. You can stay. Everything is. you want to stay? Maybe. Let me think. I can drive halfway and get you tomorrow. Can you drive him halfway over tomorrow? What's tomorrow? Ryan? I can't yeah. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. I need to talk. <laughs>
That sounded awfully human for a second. That did sound oh awfully God. human for a second. All right, you guys, we just drove home from Nan and Pap's house, and we are... Oh, get the kitties, get the kitties, get the kitty. Oh, yeah, she doesn't like that sound. What is that? It does not sound good. I think that's a dog. It doesn't sound so good. Maybe I'll... All right, another safe delivery from daddy -o. Thanks for bringing us home. Hey, you got a cute little, look at that. Little pin from Nana, let the mm -hmm. shenanigans begin. Yeah, mm -hmm. Nan, Nan was all duded up. She had all kinds of good stuff for us tonight. Yeah. Did you have fun, my guy? Yeah. You did, welcome awesome. home. Thank you. You fell asleep on the way home. I did. Right, you wanna share what made you oh, happy? You did, didn't you? We did, I was asleep too, it was nice. What made you happy today, baby doll? Oh, what made me happy today was Definitely see Uncle Sam and hang out with his birth for him, uh, with him at his birthday, and the dinner we had afterwards was amazing. Uh, and it being so close cool to St. Patrick's Day, I'm St. Patrick's Day. Yeah, awesome. Yeah, so sweet. All right, what's your pin say? Let's see. My pin says lots of luck. Oh, that's nice. Excellent. Yeah. All right, baby. Good night, sweet dreams. I love you. Mwah. Thanks for being so awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You're like a ace bowler. No, horrible. <laughs> and Brennan is home. How was your basketball game? Fun, but we got killed. Yeah. All right, so we finished second in the state. That's what it They've never been there before, so. All right. Shout out to the boys. But I'm glad you guys were all there to support them. That was nice. Facts. Yeah, the student section was really big. Good. Did you guys do a lot of cheers? Yeah. Well, oh. for the beginning. Oh, when it was okay, and then. Yeah. Close. And everybody was depressed at the end. Okay. It's fine. All right. What made you happy today? Mm. You had a big day. Going to the game. Water polo. And hang out with video this one. Oh, good. You have a big, big day. Fantastic. All right, water polo game tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. We are up uh, at 7.30. Or, I'm sorry, out at 7.30. <sighs> there at 8. Game at 9. Then a game at 10.50. Then another game at 2.30. And then prep. Bruh. Big day tomorrow. Bruh. Good night, sleep. Can I see James? I love you. Hey guys, it's Katie, and you can't see me because I'm in the dark, and I'm in Natalie's basement, and Natalie's over there, but you can't see her either. Anyway, so we'd be happy today was going to the basketball game and being with Natalie because she's the best. Mm. So yeah, Natalie, what made you happy today? Um, going to the basketball game. And being with Katie and getting McDonald's. Mm -hmm. Yay. So comment below, made you guys happy today. We'll see you tomorrow. All right, our night has ended. I am getting ready to go to sleep. And I wanted to share what made me happy too. The kitties are upstairs, you might hear them. They got their new bells on. They're doing well with their new bells, but they're making a lot of sound. Hmm. You hear that? <laughs> anyway, um, Katie's sleeping over at Natalie's. Brennan's downstairs. Ryan's in his bed, dad's asleep, and I'm about to hit the sack. So what made me happy today was, hands down, um, going to be with my family and wishing my brother a happy birthday, and bowling, and seeing my nieces and nephews, and my mom and my dad and my sister, and my brother-in-law, spending that time also with Mike and Ryan. We missed Katie and Brennan, but I know that they had a good time at the game, even though we lost. Oh, sorry, um, but there was a big debate about whether I'm not allowed to say we. Did you guys hear this in another vlog before? Mike seems to think that I'm not allowed to say we when I refer to our high school because I don't go there. But I feel like I'm in the community and I say we lost, not they lost, because they lost might mean that the other team lost, because that's they and we are we. What do you guys think about that? Do you agree with me? Like, I think I'm allowed to call us we even though I don't go there because it differentiates between who we and they are. Anyway. There you have it. All right, so comment below what made you guys happy today. We hope you had a wonderful Saturday. We're looking forward to seeing you tomorrow and Sunday, and it's going to be a great day. All right, comment below what made you happy. See you, later. See you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.